All right, shit, we're back. Um, we th we're ripping the bandaid off here. This is the first time that we're uh, doing the Zoom call-ins like on on camera as well. How's it looking over there? Looks good. Okay, great. Um, Easton and DK, are you guys? Can I just want to hear you guys real quick? Yo. Yeah. Yeah. yeah what up? Excellent. Okay, great. Uh, the warm up three at Mike Masters on everything at Mike Masters eight zero one. We are fucking live and active for the face offs. We had Phoenix Child and Kyle Mayer, uh, Val Cohn and Hemis just came through and uh, spit and talked their shit. And um, yeah, we're gonna uh, get into our next battle here. Uh, this is one that uh, I don't know if uh, D Cohen re recalls this, but we were on stage at the warm up too. Um, after <laughs> I believe it was after Easton's battle, one of the one of them, and uh, he was like, "Yo, I want to fucking battle him." And uh, yeah, man. Yeah. Okay. And then um, so that's how that started. Honestly, as far as the gears turning in my head, and so um, Easton, D. Uh, Yo. Yeah. Yeah. So. Uh, I don't know which side you guys are on, so uh, rapper on my right, I think it's you, Easton Clark, or D. Cohen. Uh, introduce yourself. It's me, motherfucker. It's Easton Clark. I might be on your right. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, rapper on my other side, fucking introduce yourself. What's good? It's your boy, DK. D. Cohen, D-K-O-E-N, on all platforms. Hell yeah. Um, so one thing I wanted to speak about first to uh, you, Easton, is the energy that we loved. The, the, we loved the energy in the last face-off with the, you and uh, Jay Villain, and the the interaction that you and I have had um, yeah. has has just been has exuded what um, what that battle rap fucking energy is. And so I want to understand what your process has been from the last battle to to leading up to D uh, D Cohen. What what that rock process has been for you yeah i wanted to understand my opponent a lot better so i i enrolled in a peer tutor program and started working with down syndrome kids <laughs> and kids with autism so i think I, I have a better understanding of who i'm going against here okay okay <laughs> uh <laughs> d, d cohen um with look he uh, are said, those allegations true yeah <laughs> He was in the news. He was in the news. <laughs> no, I don't have Down syndrome or anything like that. No, it's it's funny that he's picking at that though. No Aspergers. Okay. <laughs> no, I, no, no not Aspergers. Even... Nothing like that. I got ADHD. I'm gonna make you feel it every single way. Oh. <laughs> um. So he. He's got jokes. So look, um, DK, I got a, a DK. I I, I want to um lean into uh, Easton's um you know, lead up with some of his, um, uh, prom promotion. And <laughs> I know that, uh, you've commented on a few things, but like, uh, outside of the creative aspect, I mean, has that like sparked any sort of fire for you? Do you not give a fuck? Like what's, what's your mind space about that? I mean, honestly, stuff like that doesn't phase me. Um, I've been in other battles before where people have made memes about me, real poet. I went against Mike, the Mormon, where he did that stuff back in the day. So it's not anything new to me. Um, for the for the fact that he's able to get some content on me where he can actually talk some shit uh, is actually something that's refreshing to me because, you know, for for a while I hadn't been in an opportunity or in a place where I had made many mistakes. Mm. And so it was really a humbling experience for me to be able to, you know, to experience that in that moment. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I appreciate that a ton. I mean, uh, Easton, with how you have been um, inside, in, in, just in the battle rock community, and how much you've really dove in uh, head first, what what are some of your expectations after this battle uh, for folks to continue to really honestly say about you? Because there was nothing but positive feedback after your battle with Jay Villain, and the fact that you freestyled a lot of that um, was, I mean, yeah, it's impressive. weird, motherfucker, still fucking with me after that. Shout out Jay Villain, he did his thing. My expectations. Are the same. I'm gonna. I'm trying to fucking kill this motherfucker. I'm not. I don't know what this other energy's been about. I've been watching the whole time, trying to turn the heat up a little bit. My expectations are. I don't know. I hope he does better than last time. I don't want this to be to sound ooh eek. And none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I expect him to do better. I think he freestyled a lot too. I hope yeah, to I God that was freestyle. Yeah. 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 Um. 
So I think, you know, he probably went home. Maybe he, like, polished up some of his bars he forgot. Maybe he tailored them to me. I expect him to not freestyle so much. I think we probably both took from that and learned a little bit. But I expect him to, oh, do, yeah. to do way better, you know? Yeah, that was going to be it's my so question because both of your guys' battles were, you know, I would say they were pretty I, close against your opponent. So mm. what, I guess, what other things or what other approaches are you guys taking so there's like no question like okay you know i won or you know that there's it's not like a split decision to where it's just like hey you know he got the win no question interesting well, i wrote more this time and i'm i i expect him to write more than one syllable at least that's what i want to hear from him. <laughs> yo Ethan. what about you yeah hey man I if that's all he can say about me, I'd say I'm doing pretty damn good. No, that's not all I can say. As far as, as, far as what that's going, um, there's a lot more preparation involved for this battle. Uh, a lot more, you know, wordplay, getting more punchlines, getting things that I feel like will stick with people better. Stuff that, um, you know, it's better to get out easier than me trying to say some shit like unique. And fucking that up so that some guy like Easton can make a little video about it and oh, spend, you know, I'm sure he had to take YouTube tutorials and all sorts of shit to figure out how to do that <laughs> little editing video. So I'm really glad that you learned some Easton and really have been applying yourself uh, better, you know, uh, from some of the things that I've heard about you. So it's good to see you doing something Thank positive. You. Thank you. I'm You're trying. welcome. I <laughs> yeah, iMovie is a hard program to learn. I must admit. Yeah, that. man. Damn. See, I'm sure it was for you, bro, but I'm glad that you got it down. <laughs> you chip my with the motherfucker. All right. What's next? Okay. Day? Yeah. 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 Okay. Um, do you, Eason, um, and I know that there's a, there's a, a fun energy kind of here, but also, you know, uh, a little bit of callousness. Um, w for real, do you think that even though, I, I'm just going to go out and say, do you think that this battle was a st it, potentially, a step down and uh dk do you think that this is a step down or is this a you know what what does that look like for both of you guys i think it's a step down for sure i'm only coming to clear my name i wouldn't be coming for this motherfucker i wouldn't be traveling for that if it wasn't just to clear my name i think it's a step down but uh i mean he asked for me i didn't know that that's interesting yeah, he doesn't remember when I came up so, to him after the battle against Jay Dillon because he was too fucked up. But whoop. I had a conversation with him just right there on the stage, if you don't remember. I know you're pretty faded, but uh, I talked about you and I said I wanted to help his L streak continue because, you know, he skipped out on that battle back in January. He took that L and then he took that L in the warm-up too. So I'm just going to help him continue that L streak and get my W back so that I can continue on my way. Mm. Well, yeah, the battle I skipped out on. I don't know what you're talking about. When my grandma passed, and I had to go spread those ashes. Yeah, that's when my grandma passed. What were you talking about? Because you're oh, okay. You moved yeah. to Oregon. Something so like I that. didn't. That's, uh, that's, that's what you said, right? That ended up happening as well. Same post. If you can retain any memory, and no, I wasn't faded. I just you're nobody. So if you came up and talked <laughs> to me, I probably wasn't. I know that you're faded. It's okay, I, bro. I know you, you wanted to battle me. You wanted to battle me before Eric had hit me up on your opponent. Didn't Ghost flake on you? Ghost didn't show up to a battle. Yeah, the warm up. Yeah, the and then you want it, and then you, I'll battle anyone. I'll battle anyone. And so I was getting calls about that. And like, I never heard of you, but now, so I heard of your name now. But obviously, it's not a step down for you because you asked for me, mm -hmm. right? No, it's not definitely not a step down because you have a history in battle rapping. You're an actual I have battle one rapper. You, you went to uh, Bronx Cyphers. Well, I I've, did. Like, I've heard about you, and I've heard people talk about and you. I in haven't that heard that you're a good battle rapper. Thank that's you. That's fine. That's okay. That's 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 totally right, fine. Sure. I don't I care about you. that much. I, but I, I just I just wanted to give him that respect during that moment because during the battle against Jay Villain, I really felt like that was a really fucking cool battle. I really got to see Jay Villain come back, and I really got to see. A different side of how people rap like i've never seen someone rap the way that easton does like all fucking like you know tweaker-esque and shit so i was like really like took in from it man and i was like damn like i'm trying to fucking see this shit again and i'd love to fucking just put him out of his misery you know and be able to bounce back from the mistake that i made against alcone and and take someone that other people talk about 
and just fucking destroy him. Wow. Um, I fucking love it. Uh, uh, do we have anybody? Who's in the chat? What do we got in the chat? Just a couple quick ones. Josh Matter, what up, East? Phoenix Child, come on. What DK. up, Matters? Uh, Row Poet, Easton's just so funny. Easton for president and for the win. Sorry, yeah, D. Cohen. Yeah. Uh, Eli, Eli Ace is just laughing. J. Villain, Easton, a killer. Uh, Keto Cash, Easton kind of shaky right now, not gonna lie. Let's You're go a bitch, win. Keto Cash. You're um, a bitch. See. Uh, yeah, he wouldn't say that. Phoenix Child, don't let that battle get to your head, bro. DK gonna be hungry for a W. Uh, he was hungry all the time. Look at him. Keto Cash, uh, Easton Cringe as fuck, bro. Look at me, bro. <laughs> Eli, <laughs> going in. Eli Ace, you know, I bet you're hungry, bro. From the new gen. Um, no. <laughs> stuff. Keto Cash, DK definitely stepping down to give Easton a chance. So a lot of the back and forth. Mateo okay. Grunge, Who's that Keto talk on him for a reason. And then uh, EA801, I don't know what's going on, but I'm here for... I'm here. Hashtag threatening aura. Nice. That's my shit. That's Easton's yeah. joint. Yeah. Yeah, I'm super scared. <laughs> <laughs> so I, yeah, I have I, a um a question. I find it studios, baby. That's what, the best what's one of those questions on there about? Oh yeah, say that for the camera. Say fuck hive minded one more time. Say fuck it again. Fuck you and everything you fuck with. Fuck hive minded studios because you're wearing it. Go down. That's Hell all. Yeah. Affiliated that's with you. Like Keep them I'm sure that that's gonna go great. <laughs> okay. Hey. Yeah. Um. Uh, Easton, I, I do have a question. Um, D. Cohen has a song about fighting addiction um, and overcoming. Does that uh, grind your gears? I fuck with that. Okay. Yeah, I like that shit. Yeah, that's that's the shit I'm on. So, you know what I'm saying? It's a fucking all out. It's a, it's a battle every day. So, I'm not, you know what I mean? I'm going to battle you. This shit is nothing. I got much bigger things going on. And if you're familiar with that, you should know. I expect you to come with some different angles, hopefully. Yeah. You know, I don't want to hear the same shit every round again. But Be I'm glad Jay Dillon did that. I'm glad we got that all out the way now. Now what? You know? <laughs> well, me too. I think uh, I think that was honestly, uh, you know, getting it out in the open and being like, okay, cool. I mean, mm -hmm. if, uh, I mean, he's just, yeah. just addressing immediately. So I, I, I mean, I, I'm never not a fan of something like that, of ripping band-aids off in that in that respect, proverbially. Um, sure. What about uh, DK? Does um, in that same vein, <laughs> uh, no pun no intended. Pun intended. <laughs> yeah, no pun intended. <laughs> um, does does Easton's past uh, uh, dabbling in drug use offend you? Does it what offend you? It cut out. Does it offend me? No, anybody that has an addiction or anybody that has something where they need to recover from it, it doesn't offend me in any way. It's something that I'm hopeful for them to continue on that road to recovery, continue on every day is a journey. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, me, myself, I haven't had that in my experience where I've been addicted to hard drugs like meth or heroin or, or pills. But my my parents, uh, they're they're strung out, still out in the streets, man. And I, mm. I, it, it breaks my heart to see shit like that. And I'm an advocate yeah. for it because I got to grow up in it. And whether I like to be, it wasn't my choice, you know what I mean? And, mm -hmm. and a lot of people, it's not their choice. And a lot right. of people get caught up in the wrong things. And before they know it, at a young age, people that I was going to school with that were 11, 12 years old, smoking dope, fucking drinking. And it was just a lifestyle that you grew up around. And it was so normal to everybody that... When, once you got older and you started really meeting those people that were like, yo, dude, you're fucking weird, and you really started to acknowledge it, a lot of people, it's too late for them. And so, no, mm -hmm. I'm never offended by anybody that has any addictions, any issues with substance abuse. I'm hopeful for them, and I, I, I'm in their corner to be able to root for them to overcome that. And, and that's what I advocate for heavy. You know, I like that. I yeah. like that. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. yeah, I did. I got. I got into. I got addicted to heroin as a junior in high school. You know, I'm like, I got five years clean now. So it's, wow, That's it's amazing, still bro. it's still a daily thing, you know. But I, I, I like to help motherfuckers out. I like to sponsor homies. I like I'm part of the program. But I empathize with that because I, with yeah, that, you know? yeah. And as far as my material, I'm not coming to pick at someone for something that they've done in their past you know what i mean hmm. i don't really know anything about easton besides stuff that i've heard from like the battle that i witnessed 
and then just like seeing some stuff through different entities. But it, it's more or less coming with good punchlines, intricate references and metaphors that I can use to to punch through rather than focus on things that are petty, you know, like focusing on something like nothing against Jay Villain. He just took that angle, but he went really, really fucking low to get that W. He was really wanted that W that bad that he Ooh. went there. And so I don't think people need to do that shit um, to get a dub. And I don't really plan on, uh, you know, digging so deep that I need to, you know, get the name wrong and talk about somebody's friend that may or may not have overdosed or something. You know what I mean? Like that shit, in my opinion, I, I don't like that type of shit. And I like to keep that out of my bars. And anybody can do that. You know, if they want to catch the dub that way, shout out to them. But I, I take my approach differently. I mean, so, and yo, go ahead. Uh, uh, I was just going to say there's several layers to that. Obviously, I appreciate both of you guys' responses about uh, folks that are overcoming addiction. And um, I, I resonate highly with that and, and uh, empower those that are looking to um, grow and better them better their lives. Um, and, you know, if it's not the right time, if it's not the right time, then so be it. But uh, if you have family members, I just want to nail down on this really hard is that if you do have family members that are uh, hurting here uh, in that, in that uh, capacity, um, there are, um, uh, cut out a little bit there are programs out there. Cut out for us. I don't know if it did for anyone else though. uh, Well, there are programs out there to be able to help. Um, To go ahead. Well, I was going to say with all this Kumbaya Kumbaya stuff. Okay. I I was going to say, you know, come on. This is, I'm not in therapy guys. Okay. (laughs) I'm like, Fine individual, my life is okay. I got the Lord, okay. Yeah. So I just want to know, uh, Easton Clark first. Uh, why should I believe in you to get a win, and then the same for DK? Like, how, why can you get? You know, why should I cheer for you? Like, what? How are you gonna guarantee like that. me that you're gonna win? Well, I'm traveling 800 miles for this, <laughs> so I definitely. Uh, hold on, hold on, sorry. Yeah, I'm, it's a big deal to me. I prepared a lot for this one, man. Uh, I wrote for this one. Uh, I want to. I want to. I want to play to the crowd. Uh, I love you, West Valley. You know. I you love know, you, West Valley, Valley bro. <laughs> 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 I fuck with High Minded Studios too. I just be talking my shit sometimes. I know, bro. <laughs> Me too. You know? Yeah. DK, same question for you. So I really like the position that I'm in right now. I like that people are making jokes about me. I like that Easton's popping out with these memes and shit. It puts me in this position where everybody's like, you saw it in the polls on Mike Masters. It's like 80% is saying Easton's going to win. It just really gives me a place to come out and really give people some shit that they didn't expect because they didn't get to see 100% of me in my battle against Falcone. They got to see a glimpse of it in the first round and a glimpse of my storytelling in the second round. And I really just want to give the people what I know that they deserve to see um, and and bring that entertainment back uh, for this next battle and make it just entertaining as fuck and come out and just fucking take the dub. I fucking love it. I I I highly believe in both of you guys. That's why you guys are both back. Yeah. Great match. Yeah, it's an incredible match. Um, And outside of this uh being part of this community uh dk i'll start with you thank you so much for trusting in our process and what we're doing as a league and uh easton you know you and i have um spoken depth as well uh about what Mm -hmm. um you know the community means for you and for for me as well so i just really appreciate you guys both and looking at seeing a fucking show as from the host perspective. And I know that the people um, are going to get that from you guys. And the end footage is going to be one of those that are going to be fucking replay as value. So I appreciate that. Do we have any comments, anything? Yeah. So keto cash, I'm just going to summarize still hating on uh, Easton. Uh, <laughs> you got Josh matter saying Easton three zero bad style clash for DK. Um, Phoenix child hating on hive mind. Damn. LOL. And I watch it back. <laughs> I walked it back. I walked it back. And uh, Row Poet, Easton, two to one. Jay Villain, I changed the name to Rhyme and go out of respect for Easton. I don't know what that means, but yeah. Anyways, still. I don't know what that means, I got you. (laughs) That's that's what we have in the Okay. All right, great. Well, uh, final, final, gentlemen. Uh, fucking thank you guys both for being able to um, hop on. Uh, we've said this multiple times, just as long as you guys are on, that's fucking incredible. So we certainly appreciate it. Um, Easton, 
let everyone know your socials so that folks can um you know follow you and, and everything yeah it's just my it's as phoenix child said he i don't have a rap name Woo. Yeah. Kendrick Lamar, you dumb fucking bitches. <laughs> I'll be nice to you. Well, no, for now. But yeah, um, Easton Clark underscore on Instagram. Easton Clark on Spotify and all them streaming platforms. I'm really not too active on Facebook. I don't have Twitter. So Instagram is okay. probably the best route if you want to see what's going on. The music is just all, you know. I got some shit on SoundCloud you won't find anywhere else copyright shit uh yeah Hell real yeah. name some gimmicks you know dk <laughs> dk your your socials and everything oh sorry i was cutting out uh okay. it's your boy dk i'm d cohen on most uh at music platforms it's d k o e n you can find me on instagram black black dk that's b l a p b l a p d k it's that sound that i was making that easton uh recorded um you can find i don't have a lot of music out right now just a few singles on spotify apple music i got all my stuff with grind mode ciphers that's available on their mm. youtube i know they're coming out in vegas they got another one in august to come to salt lake so we got some other stuff that's coming out um so that you should keep your eyes out for hell yeah okay well i mean gentlemen i'm looking forward to some fireworks between you two no bullshit um on all the all the all the kumbaya shit aside, like I said, uh, I mean, For obviously, real, you gotta stop doing this shit, making me like my yeah. opponent. Come no, 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 on, I know. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. Apologize. Yeah, 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 I apologize to the fuck community about this. <laughs> I, although I do appreciate the message underlying, but uh, sure. still, even still, Easton Clark, Decon, we are fucking excited to warm up three March seventeenth, man. This upcoming yeah. fucking Friday, bro. We're gonna we're we're in it, man. Um, we're going to take a quick intermission. Thank you guys again for uh, joining and stay live with us. Stay tapped in. The chat is fucking active. Uh, thank Yo. you guys for riding with us. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you for the yes, opportunity. Sir. Thank y'all. The league, this is a big fucking deal. To me, so Thanks. grateful for y'all.